do not do this. See, his leg got long. I started to slip the knee line a little bit. I don't have the pressure I want now. I can't really, look at it. Look, he's all happy in there. I never want to see James happy. Yes, Amen. Amen. <laughs> when you lock this up, right here, look, there's an upward tension, and then my elbow, sorry James, comes off the ground and my shoulder replaces it. I don't put my shoulder on the ground over here. I bleed like that much. You see that what I'm talking about? I bleed all that energy out when I put my shoulder on the ground here. When I put, I'm gonna just do it with one hand. When I put my shoulder on the ground here and lift my butt, is this different? Yeah. Now when I bring that home and drive, that's a very violent, a very violent break. Nasty. But you're gonna bleed all of your force if you go here and lay, look at that. I don't have anything anymore. I mean, it looks like I got a pretty decent heel hook if you're not used to looking at them, but this is whack garbage, to be honest with you. Could I break James? Maybe, but I'm not gonna break somebody that knows what they're looking at right here. So, one, two, and then drive here. So, breaking mechanics. Yep, one, two, three. So, gonna go to the inside heel hook and do the break on the inside okay so here's the way I want you to drill it foot goes flat on the floor just like that and I've got him snared up at the knee line just take that foot out of the way so they can see normally we would want to control that foot right but this is just about the mechanics of the break so don't worry too much about what else is going on I just want you to partner I want you here foot flat I'm gonna lean over and put my elbow on the ground right beside his toes so, right there. If it was a match, I might lean on his toes, you know. That didn't feel good even when he just pretended no, that's, to do it. That hurts real bad, just for the record. Watch, this is gonna just lift his Achilles up and I'm gonna place it on the top of my wrist watch right there, okay? Don't turn your heel like that. Just keep your foot flat. Lift and here, got it? Now my grip comes together and I close my elbow. There's a lot of different grips you can take for now, we just want to do this one. Yeah. We could go, we'll talk about some of this later in the month, some of the braking mechanics. But right now, we're just going to go here. And now my elbow is going to come off the ground. And it's going to touch my hip. And my shoulder is going to go on the ground right here. I'm not going to lay down out here and stretch his leg out, you see. I'm going to lay down, kick this out, right here. My hip comes off the ground. And now I'm in a position to drive horizontally across the mat and break his knee. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. Up, here, I'm coming off the ground, here. And now it's a, hip is off the floor and it's an easy drive right here. I don't do this. I don't ever turn him like that. I'm just guiding him the direction he needs to go to escape, All right? So we're here, one, two, wrist watch, right behind his ankle. Grip, close the elbow, come off of this elbow and onto the shoulder, straight down, here. Hip comes off the ground and I drive through his knee, right there, here and here. Pop, I break that leg. So, bang, 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 bang. All right, everybody got it? One, two, three.